good everybody welcome back to the channel my name is brad i'm with the rc supremacy nothing's changed dudes the hair is still flowing still gaining length hobby room actually is decluttering and emptying out and i hate to inform you guys i hate to inform you man but this is unfortunately our last build series and our last upload it's our last one man it's our in the rv what you what are you thinking guys we're just getting started we're just now going in and uh, i'll tell you one thing the next chapter the space we're moving into is something to hit the sub button right there i think it's right here or right here hit that thing because guys we're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna blow it up we're gonna blow it up and uh i appreciate you guys coming along man it's been an absolute unreal ride in the last year and a half <laughs> everything you've seen has been pumped out of this rv and i have got to at least show love to it so we're gonna take this last uh build and this last uh little bit of content in the rv and go extra hard with it uh we got literally 20 something days and it's all gonna change i promise you that shout out to vivian at src i'm going in again this is gonna be all src if src doesn't make it i'm gonna build it and if i can't build it i'm going on the shell so uh what you're gonna see today is all provided by him links in the description go follow him he drops fire on the daily i promise you it's literally daily monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday Go check them out. Please make sure you guys show some love in the comments. That's all I ask. And especially for Wendy. That's the name of the RV. Her name's Wendy. So go ahead and show Wendy some love. Say shout out to you, Wendy. You made it happen. You facilitate the Whatever. Shout out love. Thumbs up is dope as well. And uh, let's get right to this content, guys.
right guys, I hope you can see me right now. I'm on the opposite side of the tent, but um, guys, arguably one of the most important processes is uh, is cleaning. I'm gonna go ahead and take some simple green. It's 100% concentrated. This thing has no dilution in it, and uh, we are gonna go ahead and clean this thing with a little bit of moisture on one of these shop towels and uh, just do the best I can. Again, one of the more important parts to keep an adhesion and making sure your paint, liquid mask, any of that sticks. Here it is. We're gonna be going ahead and laying that liquid mask. Um, you saw we just cleaned that thing with the simple green. Got it really uh, dry. I took the compressed air to it in between the steps as well, just to make sure there's no little watermarks or uh, spots left behind. So uh, yeah, we're ready to go. Shooting for seven coats. We're gonna hair dry it in between just to expedite the process. If you do not have access to the hair dryer, 15, 20 minutes in 80 degree-ish temperature should get this uh, job done. Uh, working with it more, you will see it kind of change from its wet to its matte look and uh, knowing that you're ready for the next coat but uh yeah seven coats i'm running it through the high velocity gun right here behind me it's a little mini jammer coming from the compressor at max which is 100 psi and we're regulating it at the gun at 60 psi um thickness is varying i'm looking for a milky kind of watery consistency um it does come a lot thicker out of the bottle because people do prefer to uh, brush the liquid mask but uh, here we are, we're gonna go ahead and paint it. guys i don't know if you can see that pink tint on it but uh yeah that's seven coats right there um about five minutes in between on the hair dryer oh,